We've been Audubon certified since 02, so we, we definitely uh, stuck our nose in and said we really wanted these areas left as pristine as we could and uh, as we can see uh, today how important that is to have uh, what we have but have it in such a nice natural setting. Audubon is an organization that gives us tools and helps us to maintain and good stewardship of the land and the water and the birds and the bees and the butterflies. And one of our mandates is to educate and create awareness. We approached the golf course about doing a golf tournament, knowing that there wasn't one in central Alberta for Ducks Unlimited. Um, and then part of that process was kind of what else can we do for the golf, tur golf tournament and the golf community that raises a little more awareness about what Ducks Unlimited is doing in, in central Alberta. Well, I think it's really good given that we believe that's the first time that, that we, we have this kind of relationship and we really want it to be a long-term one because there's so many good things Ducks uh, Unlimited do uh, not only here, but in the, in the whole area. I mean, right in the town of Innisfail, they have a number of, uh, of other things that they're doing that are, are really uh, pro-environment and really helping uh, the kind of place that we all want to live in. So we started doing um, some community awareness stuff and, and getting the name out there. And one of the things was these nest boxes that we could have little people help us build and then it raises their awareness about Ducks Unlimited and giving back to the community. The junior forest uh, wardens, they built the, uh, the uh, duck uh, nesting boxes for us. So, you know, we, it's brought a lot of people together, which is really, really good. We had the, do the wood donated and all pre-cut by one of our volunteers. So as literally, you know, the little folks and their families got to show up and put the nest boxes to together done in about an hour, hour and a half, and it was a great day for them. We have a lot of birds here, and we're hoping we'll get new species. Like for instance, we just put up a purple martin birdhouse, because we don't have any purple martins here, and we will see if we can attract some. And the same goes with the ducks. There's different species of ducks that we haven't had, but we know they're in their area, and so hopefully it will attract different species. So it's this great circle effect of these kids coming out on the course and seeing what they got to put together, showing grandma and grandpa what they built and now what it's doing for the golf course. People have this perception that if you're an Audubon certified golf course and if you're environmentally friendly and you have wildlife habitat everywhere, that it must just be a place where everything is just growing unruly and, and messy. And that is not so. That is what we can show people, that you can still be a well manicured golf course, you can still have wildlife habitats, and the golfers are not affected. If you present information like this to kids in an exciting manner where it's hands-on and they can see it vis visually, the impact, it, it, lets it, it rolls on its own, really. Um, kids are very, they're a lot like sponges. Once you give them the information and the reason why, they will carry it forward. They will teach other people.